Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, fellow Toastmasters and guests, and especially to our marketing queen, Ming Feng. <laughs> now, Ming Feng, for P1, there was a very wonderful speech to say to you. You have amazing vocabulary, you articulately very fluently, and amazing content. Can we have another round of applause for that? <laughs> now, Ming Feng, you introduce yourself as an introvert, but to be honest with you, it's hard for me to see you as an introvert. You know why? Reason being is that you have this incredible confidence. When you are speaking, you have, you have great posture. You flutter yourself to the ground. You, hard, you barely move at all, showing that confidence of yours. And of course, you, have, you, articulate, your, you articulate your ideas clearly and fluently. And one of the great things is that you are able to remain calm throughout your speech, despite Sarah making fun of you. <laughs> and that, that incredibly boosts your, uh, the audience belief in you. And not only that, your title, your title was intriguing. You know when I, when I first uh, heard your title, how did I join Toastmasters? You, you know what I thought of? I thought of that you are going to talk about Toastmasters refreshments. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is, this, is an, this, this is an inside joke. Of course, for those who know it, it's, it's incredibly funny. But even for those who doesn't know what it's about, it's invoking a thought like, what is he going to talk about? How does he join those masters? It makes us think, which is good for a title. And now, you also live up to your title as a marketing creator. You're, you're incredible at selling yourself. And, not joking. What I mean is that you are incredible at um, establishing your credibility. <laughs> what I mean is that when throughout your speech, when you are talking about your INC, your PM, or whatever club that you have joined, you are able to set. Don't knock that out. <laughs> you are incredible at telling us on what you do and what are your achievements. You tell us that when you join INC, the marketing goes up 700%. Wow. <laughs> and then you, are, you use strong words such as marketing queen. You know, instead of using words like that, I'm good at marketing and the sales go up, it has a different impact when you say that I'm a marketing queen. It, it, gives, the, it gives the audience a more memorable words to you. However, despite such a wonderful speech, I still have a few suggestions that I can yeah, well, so suggest. One of it is that you tend to look up a lot. It's like you're praying to the girl or something. <laughs> so when you're talking to people, like, blah, 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 blah. good evening, ladies and gentlemen. You try to establish more eye contact with the audience, and that will establish more of your credibility, and incredibly boost your even more of your great confidence. And one more thing. I don't know why, but you have incredible affection to this remote. You know when you know when you when you were talking, you're holding it such as like I'm, it's, it's like this is someone's going to rob your remote. <laughs> I don't know why, but you were holding it like this. But of course, um, what else you did you didn't do it on purpose. But of course, it's something to do. Uh, all in all, you have incredible potential as a speaker. I'm glad you finally joined Toastmasters. I know I'm out of time. <laughs> <laughs> I look forward to your next speech. Back to you, Toastmasters.